Here on MLB Now, we love crazy, innovative ideas. Tom Verducci is here to present one. It's on Sports Illustrated right now, SI.com. Present your case for the thought about banning the defensive shift. Yeah, it's at least a thought, Brian. We really need to question, is it time to do something to help the hitters? And the, the idea is in a legal defense type of rule where, say, you can only position two infielders on each side of the base. In other words, that from you to triangle in right field with the shortstop, second baseman, first baseman against the left-handed pole hitter would be illegal. Why would you do that? Because that shift is really taking away hits from pole hitters, especially the left-handed hitters. You can't play your shortstop in short left field, mm -hmm. but against lefties, you can play your shortstop in deep second base or short right field. And that's taking away not just ground ball singles, but line drives that were hits before. Mm -hmm. Think about this, Brian McCann, we saw that in the highlight there. He's banging his head, yeah. literally yeah. and figuratively. He, this year he has three ground ball singles to right field. None when there's nobody on base. Oh, so he literally can't get a ground ball mm -hmm. through that overshift. All right, can I take this first? Because I have to say, I love that you're thinking about it and you're writing about it because all things should be thought about, wondered about, and attacked in the game of baseball. However, why not let the natural counter strategy take effect where hitters will then utilize the other part of the field? That needs to happen, and I think it will happen. The question, Brian, is how long will it happen? Now, Joe Madden, the Rays manager, told me it has to start low minor leagues. You're not going to take a major league hitter like a Brian McCann and turn him into an all-fields hitter. Not happening. So now you're talking about years, maybe five years, before we see that show up on the major league level. Can baseball continue to put a product out there in which you can't separate pace of play from declining offense? Less action, longer games. Do we need to help that along? And it's just an idea. Maybe that's one thing we need to look at. What do we think? Yeah, I think we spent we spent so long bemoaning the uh, not we personally, but spent so long bemoaning the, the evolution of the game into a very power oriented game with a lot of big, slow left handed sluggers. Suddenly now we're, we're worried that there are dying species. I mean, this strikes me as a little backwards. You know, the lower offensive uh, scoring rates give us a, a wider diversity of, of tactics, more, you know, more hit and run, more, more, more uh, stolen base is more bunts you know those those one run strategies have a little bit more value in, in, a, in a lower offense environment I think we're still going to find some equilibrium here let's remember some teams aren't even as effective uh, on batting average on balls in play when they're doing the shifts I think that some of them are going to look at the numbers they're going to pair back and 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 this will balance itself out in time just think about this for Brian McCann uh, Ryan Howard Big poppy, exaggerated shift. Just think how much of that diamond from second base to the third base line is wide open hitters need to start taking advantage if teams want to play mm -hmm. this over exaggerated shift then it's time for some of these hitters to start making an adjustment you have half of the field that they're basically giving to you I love that you bring it up I think it's a t it's a does a mad dog Russo. it's a terrible idea <laughs> it's an awful idea yet uh, no that has to be examined but you're gonna put a line straight up and down the middle of the field and have guys you can't walk over on it I mean it just it it's really a, can't happen well, right well I mean I've heard a lot of baseball people not a lot but hitting coaches especially say we need to at least start thinking about that something needs to be done.